Well, good evening. Yes, here we are, arrived in the beautiful Sunny Lake District. Check this out, summer has actually arrived. Amazing, we can't and believe it. Yeah, it's a beautiful <laughs> evening. Yeah, it certainly is. Um, and we're up here this time for a reason. Mm -hmm. We've got uh, an experience to do tomorrow. Um, yes. Got a present off our mate Chrissy, uh, which was the Adrenaline Pass experience at the Honister Slate Mine. Yeah. So it looks, we've had a, a little look in, into it. Yeah, briefly. Uh, the website doesn't give too much away, actually. Uh, but it's three things, three activities that you do, starting with the Infinity Bridge. Yeah, there's some long bridge, thin bridge over a big ravine. Tight rope kind of thing. Mm -hmm. um, then we go and climb the mine. Um, don't know what to expect from that at all. No, really. you're inside an old mine. Um, mine workings inside the old Honister Slate mine and some climbing involved. Yeah, I've never climbed before at all. I used to do a bit, used to love it. So you kind of looking love it, forward so to you're that bit. looking forward to that. I'm a bit nervous of that. Mm -hmm. I'm a bit nervous, full stop. And then there's the last thing, which we have looked a little bit more into, which we're both really nervous about, to be honest. <laughs> yeah. And that is the jump. The jump. Which yeah. is a jump off, a, I don't know, it's about a, well, it's a bridge over a ravine. And you've got a, it's a rope with a kind of inertia reel above it, I think, from what I've seen. Kind of like a bungee Sort thing, of a bungee I jump. I suppose you have to jump off yourself. Mm, but it's a big drop and it's a long way down. And we're both really nervous about it, aren't really, we? Really, <laughs> really scared. Don't know if I'll be able to do it, to be honest. But we'll see. I'll see how I feel when I get there. So we're going to have a, a few drinkies and enjoy this sunshine this evening. Absolutely. And then we're going to be up bright and early and head on up to Honister. Yeah, fingers crossed the weather stays like this. Mm -hmm. And yeah, it'll it'll be good. It'll be an experience. It's good to let's, push yourself. Let's hope so. <laughs> <laughs> so we shall catch up with you when we arrive tomorrow, I think. Yep. We'll see you then. Well, we're here. We're going in. We're checked in. The weather's brightening up. It's been raining on the way up, but it looks pretty good now. So let's go and see what this is all about then, eh? <laughs> Ready. No. <laughs> and what's the drop below the bridge? About a thousand feet. Ah, that's all. <laughs> Nothing. <laughs> right, here we go. You okay? So we've had to wait, there's only six allowed on the bridge at a time. And on we go. Literally walking the tightrope. That's okay, take your time. You're happier side footed than long footed? I'll let you go a little bit. Some pretty epic views from up here. Up to you, whatever you whatever you feel better with. Kind of slightly diagonally, I'm finding, is working quite well. No, no, I'm going normal steps. So I hope you can hear me. This is chest mounted GoPro mode. And uh, in case we hadn't mentioned, this is our first activity out of three, and this is the Infinity Bridge, which is about 
300 feet, I think, from tip to tip. And I think once we get over the highest drop part is about, I don't know, 300 feet down. And how are you finding it? Wave to the camera. Hi, I'm <laughs> You're doing good. Keep it steady. Some amazing views though. The weather's cleared out lovely. And I think I can hear a, a couple of waterfalls over to our left, which we might get to see in a minute. We are starting to get out over the uh, really exposed bit now. Uh, I'll try and shifty the camera around in a second, give you a little bit of a view. So we've got over to our left, this uh, complex of waterfalls, quite the ravine. And over to our right, the open valley, which is absolutely stunning. And down below us, one hell of a drop. <laughs> but we're not even over the steepest bit yet. But yeah, quite a long way down. But we're cracking on, it's all good. You doing okay? Doing okay. Loving it? Top wires are better. Yeah, these top wires we're holding on to here are much better. We started on these, but they're a bit wobbly, the lower ones. <laughs> <laughs> So I think we are approaching the middle and it's getting rather wobbly, isn't it? Excuse probably the sound of the carabiner hitting the GoPro. Not much I can do about that. Right, yeah, I think this big metal V is the middle. Whoa, wobbly. Yeah, that's quite a long way down. Okay, let's crack on. Enjoying it? I am now. Yeah, it's good. It it's now. good once you get into the, uh, the swing of it, isn't it? <laughs> probably the scariest thing I've ever done. Yeah, I think that's probably about the uh, furthest distance down. See that it is a long drop. I wonder, did they get anyone that just freezes? Yeah. Probably. Okay, we'll give it a try. It's photo time. You ready? Left arm out, right, uh, left leg out. Cool. <laughs> Whoa, wobbly. On terra firma. What did you think of that then? That was amazing. Wicked. Shell Honnold. <laughs> it's surprising how much energy it uses when you're not moving much, isn't it? How's it going? Yeah. That's it, don't sweat. You're doing good. <laughs> He hooks the other side, that one's a bit sticky. Okay. That's it, that's shut. Yeah, that's good. On we go, cool. Just where your left knee is, yeah, perfect. Use the strength in your leg. Big push up. Yes. Alright, now, really quick, get your clips into that next loop. Yeah. Nice. Now you're going to step up one more. That's it. 
and now there's a staple on the right for your right foot, like kind of bottom right. Yeah, that lower one. This one. Yeah, you want to get on your right foot on there. So, so bring your left foot where your right foot is. That's it. Bring your feet together. So, yeah, and hold on to that long staple with both hands. Both hands reach up. Yeah. Get your other hand on there. That's the one. Yeah, that's it. Right, and now you want both your feet on that staple. You're going to bring your left foot over. Reach up nice and high now. Well done. Go, babe. That's perfect. Keep stepping up now. That's it. Well done. Yes. Yeah. Well in. That's it. That's the tricky bit. Cool. So before you, before you go any further, just transfer your clips over. It, you've done it. Flying. Well done. Brilliant. Loving it. Great. It's cool, isn't it? Yeah. For another bridge. Go. <laughs> well, that's the climb through the mine done. And we are now heading up to the jump. <laughs> so this is Shell's jump. <laughs> Wicked. Wow! Oh my god, God. Oh my god. Oh. Jeez. Oh. Your legs oh, stop shaking now. <laughs> and this is your route back out. Up a vertical rock face with water running down it. Happy with that, babe? <laughs> Last little bit of daredevils for today over this here bridge. Well, that was absolutely brilliant, wasn't it? The scariest thing I've yeah. ever done in my entire life. The Via Ferrata climbing was amazing. Yeah, the little zip wires were brilliant, weren't they? But that, stepping off the edge on that jump, the wow. heart was racing, absolutely, absolutely racing. Absolutely incredible. Yeah, couldn't recommend it highly enough. Do it. Wicked. <laughs> All back on the bus now. Try and stop yourself shaking. <laughs> well, here we 
are just back from the Honest Slate Mine and the Adrenaline Pass experience. Yeah, wow. <laughs> yeah, Adrenaline was right. Mental, absolutely mental day. Um, so, for anybody who doesn't know, uh, Honest Slate Mine is up the north end of the Lake District, near the Borrowdale Valley, near Sea Toller. Yeah. Uh, it took us a while to drive up from here. We're staying in the South Lake District, so it was a bit of a drive, wasn't it? Yeah, but a beautiful one. Yeah, yeah. Weather certainly cleared up for us. Yeah, it, it was it was bad this morning, wasn't it? Tipping down this morning, yeah. We thought we were going to get a soak in and be in the clouds, but yeah, it was, it was gorgeous, great, wasn't, wasn't it? it? So yeah, we started off with the Infinity Bridge, didn't yeah. we? Which was that uh, that thin wire rope bridge, which was about I think three hundred feet in length, and they reckoned a thousand foot down to the bottom of the, the ravine below. Yeah. Uh, uh, it would move when you, it wobbled. you were on it. Um, yeah, I wasn't sure. I had a wobble when I first got on it, and uh, but the it more you did it, yeah. it, I mean, yeah, it was fabulous. The, and, the best views of the day oh, from there. Views were amazing, and they're very safety conscious. You know, talking you through. You had your two lanyards with your hooks on. You always had to have one point of contact all the time, and. Uh, they made sure that we uh, we had a little practice run on yeah, dry land, didn't we? Yeah, absolutely, yeah. But that was amazing, um, getting all the way over that. And that was followed by the climb through the mine experience. Yeah, which was something I didn't really know what to expect of that, but I absolutely loved it. It was, it was probably one fantastic. of my favourite parts of the day. Yeah. Um, lots of sort of... Um, it's the Via Ferrata, Via Ferrata, they call it. So these kind of metal bolts into the rock. So you've got footholds and handholds, but it's still, it's tough going, isn't it? Yeah, um, and that's a, a point I wanted to touch on, I suppose, with uh, our guides, Seb and Matt. Seb and Matt, brilliant. Shout out to those Absolutely. two. Absolutely, they were both very intuitive. Um, yeah. Seb picked up on me, needed to, I needed to be talked through one of the more difficult Certain, parts like of the climb. Crook section, excuse the fly by the camera. Um, <laughs> yeah, and he talked me through that. I said, you know, put your foot here, go for this one. Yeah, loop that on. really helped, didn't it? Yeah, it really helped. Um, and again, when I did the the jump, Matt was very good at calming me we'll down. We'll get to the jump in a sec. Yeah, but yeah the um, um, the climb through the mine. There was one little bit towards the end as well. We kind of descended about forty five degrees through this very thin mine shaft. I'm not sure how well this will have come out on video. Yeah. Uh, because they told us to switch our head torches to just a little tiny red LED to kind of simulate the sort of lighting that the miners would have experienced back in the day. And it was mad, it absolutely was. mad. You couldn't really see. You were kind of feeling round for the handholds and really had to look yeah. for the footholds. and Your eyes had to adjust. Didn't yeah. Um, and, and that whole experience was a lot longer than I expected yeah. it to be. Um, there was a zip wire. Yeah, there. there was a zip wire and a Tarzan swing. A Tarzan um, swing. I oh. used the GoPro, so I'm hoping all this has come out on video. <laughs> we'll yeah. see. Well, we'll see. But um, it was and then, yeah, brilliant. we finished off with the jump. Now, we were both pretty nervous about that, to be perfectly honest. I didn't think I was going to do it. I thought I was going to sideswipe it. But um, I'm really, really glad that I did. Yeah. I pushed myself. It was, it was the highlight of the day, really. I mean, it was over pretty quickly, but my God, it was uh, adrenaline pumping. I've never so, felt anything like it, that yeah. moment when you step off and you, it's pretty brief as Pete says, but you, the free, free fall, fall. Free, free fall for a second or so, and then the, the inertia real thing kicks in and lowers you down to the, the floor, but just the, uh, the guy stood next to you saying, right, I'm going to count three and you're going to step off. And every fibre of, of your brain is going, nope, can't do this. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. Yeah, but uh, that's where Matt was great. He, yeah. You know, he's again picked up on the fact that I was really scared um, and gave me some good advice on, you know, just just do it. Don't don't linger on the edge and um, look straight ahead. And just it's he said, it's the easiest thing you'll do all yeah, day. It's just, just, just step, step off the edge. <laughs> is it <laughs> but yeah but overall so, so fabulous and you can do all these bits separately we uh, we did the adrenaline pass so it was those three things together but you can do i think any combination of those they do the, the via ferrata experience they do all sorts of other stuff yeah and uh tours around the mine as well which i'd like to yeah. do at some point uh but yeah great place really great well setup. organized really great guides very can't, safe can't fault it. Yeah. um absolutely brilliant fabulous yeah, experience we, we loved it didn't mm. we and thank you to chrissy um, yeah thanks to chrissy for getting this for us for a present which was very kind Christmas of you present yeah i mean it was certainly something that we never would have done no by ourselves no, but it's been one um, hell of a day hasn't it yeah yeah <laughs>
So on that note, I think we'll wrap it up and uh, and say thanks very much for watching. Being a bit of a different one. We are off to get a very stiff drink. Yes, time for a <laughs> beverage. <the> <laughs> So we shall catch you on the next one. Ta-ta for now. Bye. See ya.